you know, having guys that you heard about last year, but the newcomers, uh, Alex? Jordan Allmiller is really, you know, putting a fourth, you know, he's really looking good. Right now, I have to say we got him going with the ones. Uh, he's doing a lot of stuff that I like. Uh, big guy that can run, good inline blocker, so feel good about him. Steve Borden, fast kid for his position, uh, like everything he's doing. And, uh, of course, Tyler Robinson is, you know, doing a real good job. So I'm, I'm, I'm very happy with the position right now. Neil said that you're moving Steve around to a couple different positions. What kind of versatility is that's, that's the thing, you know, it's kind of like even when I play, you know, when you got a tight end who can play H, fullback, and Y, uh, it's, it's a good access to have. And, and Steve brings a lot of that. He can line up as a fullback, as an H, and now we got him going Y. He's working more with the Y tight ends now. And he's doing a pretty good job. He's a big, explosive guy that can run, and then he got strength to him. So, you know, as long as you get them guys in that 240 range, 6'3", and the athletic, they can really help your offense a lot. So he's doing a good job. On Sunday, that you're really high on Andy Kendrick. Is he still not practicing because of the great issue from the fall? Or? No, no, no. He's he's not practicing because of uh, injury. Uh, I think Andy Kendrick's going to be a pretty good player. Just watching him run around here. Uh, can't wait to get him. But the surprise is, to me, is Jordan Allman. Uh He looks like a guy that you really can line up with and, and do some things. But he's a big 6'5", six, 6'6", six, six guy who can run, good soft hands. So, I'm, I'm very pleased with the way his jump is going this morning. Sounds like you talk about 